Yeah, you know, he was great, obviously, and uh, made some big shots and plays. Um, starting to see a glimpse of the things he can do uh, scoring the ball. Um, you know, it, like I told the guys after the game, we're, we're a game past the quarter mark. We've played, you know, uh, an incredibly dense schedule. I think we've played more games than anyone in the league. And guys were tired tonight. We couldn't buy a basket, Made had a lot of good looks. Tired shooting the ball, but also tired in that we were a little stagnant against the zone after a really good performance against it the other night. So, uh, you know, overall, just the fact that they, they hung in there and that, that James stepped up and made some big shots down the stretch. Brian Lewis with the New York Post. Brian, you're muted. Brian, you're muted. I don't know if you can hear me. All right, let's try yeah, Alex Shipman. Oh, there we go. All right. Go ahead, Brian. Okay. Uh, you had talked earlier about you wanted to be, you wanted James to be more aggressive, and you figured this was coming, that it would happen. Was this a matter of game flow? And obviously, KD wasn't hitting some of the shots he normally was. Was that game flow, or did he make a conscious decision to get more aggressive? James, I'm saying. Uh, you'd have to ask him. Um, you know, I, I, I give James uh, his space offensively. I think, I mean, he's one of the greatest offensive players to ever play the game. So I trust in him figuring out where he's at with his game and how he can affect the game. He does so many things manipulating the defense that he, he's such a positive for us, even if he's not scoring. But um, we know how capable a scorer is. And, you know, he got it going, got a little aggressive, got on a little bit of a roll and made some plays and showed what a tough cover he is. And, you know, that's, that's obviously the place we want him to get where, you know, he's confident and has freedom to create and, uh, and is, is balancing scoring and playmaking. Alex Schiffer with The Athletic. Hey, Steve. You mentioned that you guys had a bit of a slow start offensively. Then just as the game went on, you guys continued to, to improve. Was that anything tactical? Was it simple as shots just starting to go in? You're kind with a, a bit of a slow, slow start. But... Uh, <laughs> No, it, it really wasn't tactical. You know, I think, like I said, the, the, the schedule's been, you know, obviously very difficult. Um, like I said, I think we've played the most games in the league. Uh, you could see the mental and physical fatigue a little bit out there tonight. We were a little bit stagnant. The ball stuck a little bit more. We were, our thoughts were a little bit slower. And, uh, and you know, you add it all up, we couldn't buy a basket. But uh, I was proud of the guys for, for hanging in there and just finding a way to – to give themselves time, and, and obviously Miami was exhausted too, so they they uh, they didn't shoot the ball well either. And uh, but the most important thing is that our guys uh, found a way to to combat all those those ways that we could have, you know, found an excuse to lose this game. We and we kept plugging away. We guarded second half. I think we gave up 40 points, 14 in the fourth, and uh, and then our offense kind of picked up at the end there. But you know, it was. Uh, one of those tricky games. And like I keep saying, you know, we're going to see games like this throughout the season. You know, we've seen all sorts of crazy scores, crazy upsets, uh, a lot of people hovering around 500. And that's just the nature of this season. And we have to be prepared to, to win some of these games when, you know, you're, you're not feeling it. Greg Logan with news. Uh, Steve, did you uh, change anything defensively in the fourth period? You, you got 10 straight stops during that 15-0 run. Was that just because Miami was uh, a little undermanned tonight, or, or did your guys step it up uh, on defense? I mean, the coaching was outstanding, Greg, I would say, <laughs> first and foremost. Um, no, I, uh, you know, look, I think you had two tired teams out there, um, and our guys stepped up to the challenge when they, were, when they were tired. I thought, you know, Bam got going a little bit for a minute, and then Jeff stepped up and really uh, did a great job making it difficult for him. But the rest of the guys off the ball were diligent. You know, it's, it's difficult with uh, Duncan Robinson flying around out there. Um, we're having to be really crisp on our switches, really crisp on uh, our reads, uh, back cuts, and they do a good job off the ball. So. Um, you know, I, I, all the credit goes to the guys, the players, because they have to step up. We kept it very simple defensively, and uh, they did a good job down the stretch. Bruce Beck with NBC New York. Steve, you have the top three scorers in the league in the fourth quarter. What is it like to have that option, and do you know who it's going to be on a given night, or is it just kind of play out? Uh, you know, it's uh, that's 
Well, it's the way this team is built. Uh, we, 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 we went for it and, and have three great, great offensive players. So, you know, on any given night, it could be any one of them or it could be Joe Harris, uh, you know, it could be someone else. So um, those guys also make each other and their teammates better by the attention they draw. So it's about trying to find that collective threat, you know, by the ball moving, by spatial uh, awareness and understanding and making each other um, better through collectively. So, it, you know, on, on certain nights, our guys are so capable of getting hot that it could be any one of them. But uh, the idea is that it's not a, it's his turn tonight. It's that emerges and we welcome it, but it's, we're going to play good basketball. We're going to create good opportunities and we're going to step up and shoot the ball. And, and uh, if we create good opportunities more times than not, we'll be in a good position.